Logos. Don't you just love him? I love him too, but we don't have that much time for them, so... The Lego Batman movie. Too meanwhile. At a current bank robbery in progress. Oh, God. Do you see how much money we're gaining right now? Just give me a moment to calculate. <laughs> $7,734, that spells hello upside down, is that hilarious? I forgot I want humorous. <laughs> it's tea time time! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Calvin, but today's not a robot day! Darn it, you're right! That's next Tuesday! I know! I am King Tut. You are all beneath me. In time, you will all learn to respect me as your king. <laughs> it's mummification time! Oh no, not toilet paper, my greatest weakness. Wait, what are we gonna do now? They're all dead! Well, that sucks. I'm Batman! <laughs> and today we're gonna talk about how it is I became the legend I am today, which is of course, uh, I don't know if you caught my last word, but I said, I'm Batman. <laughs> so basically it all started a long, long time ago. I know what you're thinking right now, like, uh, is he really going to narrate right now? That's always the start to a real trash movie. Well, I'm going to tell you something, buddy, and I'm going to tell you this, and you're going to listen real close. This has such a deeper meaning than you think. You're just like, oh, this is a parody film on the outside. But on the inside, it's something so much more. So much more than you could ever, ever <laughs> handle. So, where was I? Okay, so basically I was this old, super hot, rich guy in white totes and stuff. And basically I wanted to become a billionaire philanthropist playboy. You know, that all typical rich guy stuff. I mean, I screwed up there. I was a billionaire philanthropist playboy. But I wanted to become a ninja fighting warrior. Basically, I went to this really suspicious faraway palace thing in the desert. Ah, whatever. And there was just this really creepy old guy. He had something wrong with his eyes, I gotta tell you, man. This guy, he was actually, he was hilarious to you. Look at that <laughs> No, but, yeah, but that's his eyes that point. Basically, he was all like, I'm gonna be Dave your creep, and I'm gonna train you how to, how to become a ninja fighting warrior like you came here for. <laughs> it was actually pretty funny, but uh, basically, I was like, okay. <laughs> now, this guy, his name was Raz Al Ghul, maybe you pronounce it Race Al Ghul. I mean, I, mean I, I, I have a problem with different races, so, you know, it's black is supposed to be the dominant one. <laughs> Unfortunately, I was born white. But anyway, Oh uh, yeah, so we we were we were pals. I trained under his little claw hands and stuff. We had our moments, but I mean, we also had another moment where I stayed up super late. I thought I was so cool. I was like, "Yo, look at the time. It's past midnight. What up? Let's do a banger." I see him, and then there's this other guy. He's like, oh, I'm so thirsty. And then Raz Al Ghul, he was all like, "Well, too bad." And then he just chops the flipping guy's head off, and I was like, "Well, that's something." So basically, um, turns out that Raz Al Ghul was like kind of a, he was, he was a villain. I mean, you can see here, he was in the villains wiki. Whoever would have expected that. So, I mean, that kind of changed our status, I guess. I also happened to skip over a pretty important part. So while I was there, I met this super hot woman. Her name was Talia Al Ghul. <laughs> I was like, whoa. And you know me, so I just topped right in there. Well, okay, that was a little intense, but you know. It just happened to be that she was actually the daughter of Raz Al Ghul. Small world after all. So then I got my battle gear and I was like, you know what? We're getting out of here. And then she suddenly had some unexpected news when I was like, all right, let's get out of here. She was suddenly like, I'm pregnant. And it was like, holy fat woman, Batman. So I was like, huh, well, what do I do now? So then I was just like, well, I'll do the obvious thing and just leave without her. 
So then I went to Gotham City and finally became who I am now known as, and that is, of course, Batman. And then about nine months later, I took a stroll down to a river, and hey, what do you know, this little baby comes floating down in a basket, and I was like, wait, that looks a lot like me, got a DNA test, guess what, he was my child. Turns out Talia did that kind of like ancient Egypt move, where like, you send your baby down a basket, floating down a river, you know, that stuff. So I was like, huh, I guess I have a child now. And I kind of locked him away in a closet, but that's a whole other story, don't worry about what I did with him. Basically, I just neglected him out of my life, and in modern days, you know I have an accepted family now that I had that whole chaotic thing with accidentally adopting a son so you know you'd think that my other son would come up eventually but let's hope not too soon <laughs> it's me your son damien wayne oh uh, no uh batman he's your son uh <laughs> son this dick over here is my son wait batman did you have another son this whole time that you hid in the closet for probably years um. Quite a pee is you and quite a pickle, huh, Master Bruce? SHUT UP, ALFRED! You adopted a dick, Batman? I'm your real blood board son, Batman! You're just a fake! Ah! By coincidence, the bat phone rings for something strikingly related to the same situation. Uh, gotta go! Oh, yo, yo, what up? It's Batman here. Gasp. The Lego Justice League movie. Wait, what was that phone call about? Oh, turns out Damien's mother, Talia Al Ghul, just arrived in Gotham City. Oh, yippee! Seriously? You better not go see her. Oh, wait, were we like a thing now? Yes? Huh, I'll be darned. The something movie, it's a, it's a sequel. What? What the? Hey, look, it's Aquaman! And Hawkman! Oh, uh, what do you know, the two most pointless and useless members of the Justice League in the same room at the same time. My hawk ears seem to have blocked out whatever remark it is you just made, Batman. We've been called in by the Justice League to tell you the rumors about the villains all teaming up in the Legion of Doom. Oh, please. Meanwhile, with the villains... So you mean to tell me that Batman just let you and every single other villain in Gotham City just simply get away? Pretty stupid, but yes. And now you want to join the Legion of Doom? Uh, yes, precisely. Wait, Luther, please, no, tell me, it's just a prank. Look at these people. This guy's whole life is revolved around light. Oh, do you have light? Nobody can understand a single word he says. Do you feel in charge? <laughs> <coughs> uh, stop, stop, you're spitting all over me. <coughs> oh, my nose was having some technical difficulties. I don't even know that you could spit through this thing. Like, I can't consume drinks, but I could spit out of here. Like, <coughs> Ginger over here always gives away his evil plan to the hero through riddles. Riddle me this. Who's wearing these plaid pants and, uh, you know what, I, I have nothing. She usually has no clothes on. Isn't that a good thing? All this guy does is deliver pizza. Would you like some? This video brought to you today is sponsored by Luigi's Pizza. No, it's not. I have no idea who this person is supposed to be. <laughs> and all of these people are just completely useless and random. It must be roast every Batman villain day. Well, I most certainly do see all of your points, Trickster. However, we could use every villain possible for the Legion of Doom. Ah, yes. <laughs> Although there is something very important that you all must know first. This is Katana. I would advise not getting killed by her. Her sword traps the souls of its victims. Yes, you have to be you. Meanwhile, back at Wayne Manor... Well, looks like I'm gonna have to take Damien over here to see his mama. Of course you want to see her. Wait, but Batman, what about the suspected villain Tima? I'm pretty sure this is more important. Really? I would just love to meet this woman as well. As would I, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, only I and Damien will go, or Damien and I don't even care, but anyways, goodbye. But what about- Hey, two useless members of the Justice League, ever wonder that maybe they sent you to come get me at Wayne Manor a far distance away, just so that while you're over here, they're actually taking care of the real mission? What? Meanwhile, with the Justice League- Justice League Assemble! <laughs>
that justice league will never stop me from transmitting this super important message go dad oh great it's my psychotic son did you know that psychotic is a three syllable word for any thought too big for little minds <laughs> It's super bad. And that was actually very predictable. The red games are coming. 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 Are coming. <laughs> ah! What have we going on here today, Lex? <laughs> oh, Superman, you are so gullible. I've already implanted a kryptonite bomb into this building that's ready to be set off in only five seconds. You better go now. Wait, seriously? Okay, fine. I, I just made that up to scare you. Uh, I see now. It, it didn't work. Okay. Bang, 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 bang. Uh, After all these years, you're still trying that? Always worth a try. Super bugs! Ah. Oh my gosh, I long as I'm gonna go. Ah. Superman, did you find out what Luther's evil plan was? He was trying to transmit a message through space. Unfortunately, we were too late and it already delivered. Is that what that satellite dish was? Did you destroy that just in case? Uh, <laughs> yeah, of course I did. I'm just gonna go do something that's totally unrelated, don't worry. Ah, <laughs> there we go. Now, Diana, did you put Lex Luthor in prison, finally? So from justice? <laughs> what? Of course I did. I'm just gonna go do something that's a completely different situation. Dang it, he got away. Meanwhile, at the entrance to Gotham City, a train station... I'm so excited to see Mommy! Oh, all I really remember, though, is when she was breastfeeding me. Hey, Daddy, is she always topless? When she's with me? Yes. What? Oh my god, that was extremely messed up and inappropriate. Why'd you even make me say that? Gosh, it's not even true, Damien. There she is, the daughter of a psycho killer. Hello, Batman. What's up, babe? Look, I I'm kind of in a pretty tough situation right now because Raz Al Ghul is kind of trying to find me now that I just escaped. And he's probably going to come to Gotham City and kill everybody, but you know. Wait, what? Are you dumb? Hey, hey, you should be in full support of this. You know what I did. Escaping from his palace place in a faraway land was the right thing. At this point, no, it most certainly was not. Well, isn't it a good thing that I'm now free, finally? No, most certainly not. And now I finally get to meet my full-grown son, Damien. This kid is extremely annoying, seriously. It's not a good thing at all. And it's also a really good thing, because now you could finally face Raz al Ghul and defeat him once and for all. No, it's not. And then you could finally end the League of Shadows. No! So this is really an opportunity of a lifetime. No, no, no. He's going to kill everybody. I don't know what you're all worked up about. You're Batman. He's probably already at Gotham, I swear. He's gonna kill everybody, and this is it. This, you just put all of Gotham at stake. Oh my god. Meanwhile, at the entrance to Gotham City, a, a different one, not the one we were just at. I don't know, I'm just reading the script. Hey, uh, man, you're not supposed to be here. Uh, Raz al Ghul. Uh, okay, not, not sure what that's supposed to be. Ah! I'm coming for you, Talia. Meanwhile, at the Hall of Justice... Oh, it feels so nice just to have a place where I can stretch out my wings and scream caca without being judged. Actually, we're all judging- Hey, you look! It's Aquaman! Okay, you don't need to say that every single time you're in a room with someone else. Sorry to upset the green one over there. I thought we could be buddies because, well, my legs are green. What the heck? Barge! 
and ready to mingle. <laughs> Loser. Are you okay? Are you okay? Sucker, I get off of me. Oh my god, Ray. Ray. Hey, that's enough. Oh my gosh. <coughs> Psychopath. <coughs> What's up, my Whoa, whoa, cyborg. Please, you're just a teenager. Want to chill on the language? Really? You're really going to tell me to f the f Really? Uh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Why are the Teen Titans even in the Hall of Justice? What the? Wonder Woman, did you get, like, a new accent? Uh, and a new body shape? What are you talking about? Uh, just, never mind. Hmm? No, actually, I, I really like it. I prefer it over the original classic Wonder Woman. You know, it, it then is my body type. It's my type. You're, you're my type. I mean, y yeah. And don't stutter on your bubbles now! My bubble. Wait, that doesn't even make any sense. What the? I cannot stand by and witness this cannibalism! Put it down, you savage! You still never answered my question. All right, listen here. I am the founder of the Justice League. I thought that was myself. Okay, fine. I, I thought it was Batman, though. Really? New 52 verse I'm talking. Cyborg, please calm down on the language. Who's Mr. Parental Controls over here? Look, I don't care about these Teen Titans. But ultimately, can I at least join the Justice League? Well, actually, I suppose to be politically correct, yeah, we we do need you, actually. Wait. Wait, no, we should all join the Justice League, because, uh, look, we uh, actually just took out every single villain that was robbing a bank. Yeah, I saw that all in the news. First of all, that was no justice at all. You literally murdered every single person. And plus, they were all the weak, lame villains that we could have all taken out within a few seconds. Well, at least we could now confirm that uh, villains are teaming up. It it, it wasn't just that they, they were working for someone else. Okay, well, that's why we called upon this meeting, to discuss that. And uh, we're going to try to make a little plan here. So basically, a group of me and the other greatest heroes of the Justice League will go down in the sewers because there have been some rumors about another gathering of villains there. A small group. Did somebody say greatest heroes of the Justice League? I believe you must be directly referring to I, the King of Atlantis. Hey, look! It's Aquaman! Honestly, would anybody care if I just lodged this arrow in his face? Fine, Aquaman, I, I suppose you just have to come. But anyways, yeah, Aquaman, Wonder Woman, Shazam, and the Flesh, let's take off and serve some justice! <laughs> Don't worry, Soups. Us Teen Titans will look out the, after the Hall of Justice while you're gone. Ho <laughs> ho You can count on us. I guarantee you we won't let you down. Uh, okay, never call me Soups again. Meanwhile, or, well, a few minutes later, at the sewers, or, well, in the sewers, I, it's not my day today. Oh, it's so nice to be back at my natural habitat. Look at all the fish in here. Wait a second! Oh my gosh! This place is so cruel! And man, the, the water smells awful! But I love it! <laughs> oh. Hey, look! It's Aquaman! And can you please be quiet? They're trying to make a stealthy pursuit here. Why, you're right, Superman! Green Arrow! Shut up! Green Arrow isn't even here. Why did you go chase after him? I'm sorry, can anyone understand a single word he's speaking of? Sorry, so that I can't have a super 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 fast. Also, I have a very rapid saliva build up in my mouth because I it does every single thing and I die. It's going super super. I I can't help it. Wait a minute, does anybody know where Shazam went?
happy thrill resolution to this. All right now, fish creature, communicate with me through the mind. We can do this. Let's just collaborate, us fish people, to get the- Don't worry, I've got this. Whoa, Diana, don't kill them. I mean, it's not because that's how the justice system works. It's because we need to get answers out of them. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, Diana. It's just so hard to take you seriously with that ridiculous accent of yours. Oh, really? That's funny because nobody ever takes you seriously considering your whole life is a joke. Don't you worry about a thing, guys, we still got Cordella Crabs left. Oh, yeah, boy. Now you listen here, you little filthy golden guy, I'm gonna stick my hand here because there's a super quick space and it's gonna kill you. Or, uh, we can do this a very easy way, and you can simply telepathically tell me the location of all you villains little baits, because I know that down here in the summer, don't you lie to me, you filthy little crab. Thank you very much for the reservation. Well, where is the base? He says it's a very suspicious warehouse. Okay, but what warehouse? A suspicious one. Oh my gosh, everyone on this team just honestly sucks. Well, that's awfully rude coming from a man who stands for justice. Aquaman, can you- Hey, look! It's Aquaman! Okay, you could seriously, like, stop screaming that. What are you talking about? Get it? Water? I think I'm gonna kill myself now. Meanwhile, back at the Hall of Justice... You'd think that at this point in pop culture, people would recognize my character. Wait, guys! Don't hurt him! Aren't the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles supposed to be our friends? Uh, uh yeah, yeah, you're yeah. right. Meanwhile, at the Bat Cave. Alright, so basically I've got a really cool bat bunker that we could use to hide from Raz al Ghul when he comes to Gotham and, you know, kinda kills everybody. But Batman, shouldn't we be the real heroes and try to fight Raz al Ghul instead of hiding? Yeah! What the dick say? Just shut up, dick, alright? We're doing what Batman says. But he goes on, Batman! So, without further ado, let's all get into a safe bunker and relax. Master Wayne, are you sure that you have a prepared well amount of food there in the bunker, depending on how long we might indeed be staying there? Trust me, that place is gonna be like an all-you-can-eat lobster thermidor buffet. Yeah, Batman, I'm sure you're just looking very much forward to spending plenty of hours with hey, your Batman, little ex-girlfriend Talia we're... al Ghul in a Stop nice, judging closed, me, you midget. safe, enclosed, very tight, claustrophobic, triggering... Now, now, Master Wayne, Booker. I hope that you will surely be behaving me, yourself. Trust me, I'm still against the fact that we're ignoring Raz al Ghul and letting him kill us now while we're in safety. You hear that, guy? You are all so annoying. Honestly, I'm just going to go in this bunker all by myself. Because I honestly... At this point, I, do, I, I, I don't care about you. You're all just, you're a mess. This is supposed to be my new family. Oh, my. Oh. You know what? I just need to take a chill pill and watch as Raz Al Ghul murders all of you. Goodbye. But Master Bruce. Oh, no, Batman. <gasps> Did he actually just do it? Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Wait now, Batman. Don't go too soon. 
because the fun is just beginning. <laughs> It's the Joker! What? No! No! I'm the Riddler! <laughs> oh, was that the Riddle just trying to figure out who you were? Well, no, no I, I, sure, but still, the fun is still just beginning! <laughs> alright, 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 can you just make this quick, because I don't have much time right now, alright, so just... Hit me with the riddle, I don't even care. I hear like a little purple question mark, dude. Green, I don't even color. I'm colorblind. Okay, riddle me this. Who comes from a faraway land seeking revenge and has just come out of a pit from down below that gives them power beyond imagination? <laughs> huh, I don't know. That, that sounds like a hard one. How many days do I have to solve this? What? Right now, Batman? You're solving this right now. It's not, it's really not that hard at all. <laughs> uh, can I buy a vowel? No! <laughs> May I have a hint? Uh, okay, fine. His name rhymes with Azul. <laughs> Is the answer Zool? No, I, I said it rhymes with Zool. <laughs> Yeah, but like, Zool rhymes with Zool. Don't worry guys, I know who to call! No! You idiot! The answer is... Razzle Duel! <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, so what does he have to do with anything? Oh my gosh, you're so dumb. He's here! In the Batcave! Right now! <laughs> I've been tracking you this whole time, Talia. Oh, hey, Grandpa! How are you? Well, I feel quite powerful, as I did indeed just come out of the Lazarus Pit. Oh, that's nice! It's so nice to finally meet you! I was gonna send away the basket as a child, and I had no idea what was going on, but you look like a pretty friendly person! Do you need a hug? Raz al Ghul, it's so nice to finally see you indeed, just as that little rascal just said. Listen, you and I have some unfinished business to take care of right here, right now. Really, Batman? Because I'm pretty sure I'm the one who was unfinished with you. You never quite fully completed your training. I don't need your fancy swords. I have these nice dagger-sized batteries. Alright, let's do this, baby! You wanna get done? Let's get done! <laughs> Stupid. Yeah, battering versus sword, not a very good idea. Well, see you in the afterlife, Batman. Talia, don't get yourself involved in this. How couldn't I? You're only here for me. Well, yeah, I mean, no, I, I'm also here to get my revenge on Batman. I have to kill him. I don't want to kill you. I just want to bring you back home. Yeah, well, I'm not going back home, so you're just going to have to fight me. Talia, I don't want to hurt you. You already have. Dramatic. Wait, I have? <laughs> Yeah, let's go against the rules of basketball, double team him! The power of the badger repelled you! Aw, oh, yes, perhaps now would be a good time to start running! So does the Batman bat too. Grandpa's got a nasty attitude! Ooh, wait, Batman, do you want me to help? Ooh, what should I do? I can wiggle my legs in space, I'm really good at that. I mean, if you want to die, yes, go ahead. Oh, Talia! Holy Bat-Cow. You, Batman. You did this. 
I mean, it was more like 99% you, 1% me, but still not intentional. You will pay for what you have done! How much money do you want? I have plenty. Whoa there, big boy! Fine! <sighs> Meanwhile, back with the villains. So that's when I said, you want to know where I got this sweet tux? <laughs> Behold, I have returned from the Batcave to introduce you all to Raz Al Ghul. <laughs> Thank you, but I believe I can introduce myself. I am Raz Al Ghul. <laughs> Can you guys, like, not look at your rape? I mean, this guy over here, he has really sensitive ears. Now, the reason I'm bringing him here is because I'm going to introduce him as our new lead. Okay, that's enough. I can, I can introduce myself. Thank you very much. Now, the reason I'm here is because I am going to be the new leader of the Legion of Doom. What? But I was already the leader. Actually, that was me. Peach. <laughs> well, what happened to you, so-called Lita? A lot of things happened, alright? I just don't want to think back to it. Did you see a light? Well, I'd say you're clearly not fit to be the leader of the Legion of Doom anymore. <laughs> Mr. J! Maybe you could be our new leader! I mean, I always thought the Sweet Puddin' would be the best leader of a group of villains! Wait now, just one calendar day! Sorry, who are you? I am the calendar man, and I have just returned from a massacre that has just happened at a bank robbery that we were trying to do so we could afford our rent at this warehouse. And now I know that the heroes are all going to team up, and they're going to defeat all of us. Uh, there's so many heroes. <laughs> okay, they're teaming up, but you already- they're always teamed up. They're, they're in the Hall of Justice at all times, basically. Hey, by the way, I happened to notice on the news recently, there's this wild gorilla on the loose, and happened to look a little bit like... Gorilla Grodd. Can I just happen to ask, why did we have that sewer mission again? Uh, mission? I'm pretty sure that Killer Croc just had to go down there to get some food, and that's where Gorilla Grodd hangs out anyways. I guess they must have been infiltrated by some heroes. That kind of sucks. Oh, yes. Now, perhaps I can introduce to you all another friend that would be very important for us to have. Sorry, my mask seems to be going through some technical difficulties. Right, anyways, who's the old guy? Oh, this, this is, uh, my, I, 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 wait, who is this? I, I don't know, it's some hostage from the Bat Cave. Well, thanks for not killing him, because now we can just have some fun with him, perhaps. Put a smile on his face, and we could, in particular, use a knife. You know why I like to kill people with knives? Well, if you just shoot someone with a gun, they die so quickly. It's just bang and they're done, but you use a knife and, well, then you could really have some fun. Carve out a little decoration on them, and when you stab someone, they die slowly, and you really get to know a person while they die. You really get to learn them right before the last moments, you know, the last thought, and that tells you a lot about a person, and... Okay, where's my butt? And the other people. What? How did you find a super secret suspicious warehouse? I played the put a tracking device on each other game just like Raz did with Dahlia. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll protect the <laughs> Well, bye. Alright, just it doesn't matter who the leader is, let's just uh probably get to killing them. With knives? Gladly. <laughs> Meanwhile, the Justice League has returned at the Hall of Justice. Don't you worry, Soopsie. I've already got the invader all tied up. <laughs>
Yeah, uh, add Soupsy to the list of names that you should never again call me. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, big blue cheese! Who is this invader that you're talking about? Oh, just those menacing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles! Hey, look! It's Aquaman! Now's really not the right time to say that. I want to hear somebody justify the reason that the Teen Titans are here. Inside the Hall of Justice, beating up an innocent, actual person that's part of the Hall of Justice. Yeah, well, I don't know about these guys, but I mean, I'm just here because I'm actually part of the Justice League now. Plus, I'm, uh, <laughs> I don't know if I have to remind you, I'm the founder of the Justice League. New 52 verse I'm talking. Does anyone know how to use a door anymore? Yeah, well, guess what? I'm talking old one or whatever whatever you call me for new 52 would that be like new 51 or something i don't know just not 52 i no one likes that all right look at this suit it's much cooler than that old gray mess thing hey what's up justice league folks it's batman uh, i just wanted to know what's up really i just rescued my family and there's a bunch of villains in this warehouse that i found super easily by the way that's actually hysterical because we were like trying to find that place for like the whole movie i'm guessing he doesn't last very long in bed hey look it's aquaman really you just said that well, I wanted to make sure that other figures, such as perhaps Batman, would also know that, hey, look, it's Aquaman! It is actually pretty hard to see out of these cutouts. I'm sorry, Aquaman, could you repeat that? My hawk ears seem to be blocking out everything you're saying. Why would you- Hey, look, it's Aquaman! Screw super hearing. Wait a minute, does anybody know where Shazam went? Sorry, can we, like, <laughs> not again? Yeah, it's pretty funny how repetitive things can get pretty annoying. What are you talking about? Get it? What? Yes, we get it. Gosh. I'm pretty sure that, like, um, I, like, dumped Sazam into the sewer water when I was, uh, running into Gorilla Grunt. You know that I get very focused on my task when, like, I'm really in the zone or something? I was just, like, I just so focused on Gorilla Grunt. I was like, you know what, I'm gonna take out this Gorilla Gorilla. I'm gonna be, like, super fast, and I don't, even, I don't mind my surroundings anymore. Ugh, why didn't you say anything? Actually, why didn't he say anything? I'm pretty sure, like, Shazam's a mute now, that- Cause he has, like, that fear of becoming a little boy again just from saying his name, so I guess that's kind of traumatic. So, let me get this straight. Shazam's a mute, Batman's blind, Hawkman is deaf, and Aquaman basically has autism. Yeah, <laughs> well, all teams have room for improvement, I guess. Uh... Some more than others. Speaking of teams, there's actually like so many villains that have assembled. You have no idea. Like, we are not going to be able to take out all of them. Like, it's all my villains, and it's all your villains, and your villains. I don't even know if Aquaman has any villains. If he does, they're probably super lame as well. But basically, uh, I didn't really care to take them all out. I could even left a bomb in that suspicious warehouse if I wanted to, but, uh, something that I heard, I overheard their plan for a little bit. I decided to interrupt them just because I thought it would be, like, a cool entrance kind of thing. Uh, but basically, I, I think it might be a little bit of a problem because, like, they're gonna try to kill all of us, and we do have a public hideout ourselves, so they shouldn't have a trouble finding us at all. <laughs> so let's just wait for uh, them to come to us. You know, that's fun, right? Uh... Hey, well, get this. I have a really good one-liner I've been saving for the moment that we meet all the villains. All right, you ready for this one? It's gonna be, hey, look, it's up! <laughs> Now's my time to shine. Hey, look, it's <laughs> Joy to the world, the Lord is come. It's nothing that my bulletproof orange chest can't handle. Oh, no wonder I'm the king of Atlantis. Hello, darkness, my old friend. 
I've come to talk with you again. Mm, at least it's him this time, not me. Oh, ah, ahoy, ahoy. What? How did he get here? Next category, circles. Round and round and round they go to find Superman. Mm, wrong category, boy. No, no, triangles. Yes, Euclid's triangle inequality. The shortest distance between any two points is a straight path. And I believe the straightest path to Superman is a pretty little road. Oh, my only son. I'm so sad. You heard him. Ah, well, it's time to do yet again my favorite hobby. Serve some justice! I'm taking my hood off for this one. Oh, my greatest weakness! Yellow! Oh, it's so bright, solid blood! His ah! hair is so uh! yellow! Okay, really, guys? Raz Al Ghul, you and I have some unfinished business again, yeah. No, I believe I was the one who was unfinished with you, because you left my daughter to die. That was like an instant death. I mean, I would I would totally be up for like a five minute dragged out dramatic death for her, but I mean, she just she just plopped down to the ground <clears throat> after you stabbed her. Ah, uh, well, anyways, my main purpose to come here was to kill you in the first place, so I'm not leaving with that problem unsolved. All right, fine. I got my bat armor already. And what? Are you going to use bat rings again? <laughs> You're so funny, Raz. Look, I've got my BAM Excalibur bat suit. That's a real thing? No, but now it is. Oh no, you flew me down to the ground. Not like that little sword of yours is gonna go and penetrate my metallic armor. It's the uh, it's the, it's like it's like armor of a, a knight, a knight in shining armor. <laughs> well, I could still easily go through any of the slits in your mask, but anyways, now this is where it all begins. I will wipe out the heroes of today's modern day, and I will now finally have a land to rule over myself. <laughs> Wait, what? I couldn't help but to overhear. You said that you were going to rule everything after you kill all the heroes. I mean, you got the first half right. We're, we're wiping out all the heroes. But the second half is we're basically doing this for Darkseid and who we're going to rule beside. You know, I mean, we can't really overpower him. So I, I say we just we just say like the little the, the sidekicks. You are all weak. So weak. And he's just right Oh! Oh, my back. Oh, I've fallen and I can't get up. Oh, oh, it hurts so bad. What just happened to your face? What, what, what do you, oh, no, oh, oh no, no, the power, of the, the Lazarus pit, it, it, it's faded away. I don't have it anymore. I'm just, I'm just going to crawl away. Very gentle, smooth. Just don't mind me crawling, crawling. I'm just crawling. Don't worry, don't worry. Just let it happen. Batman, what are you doing? Gotta respect the elderly. Ah, uh, well, anyways, I guess you all know our plan, so can we just get this battle done and over with? <laughs> oh, Lexi, baby, I like the sound of that. Preacher John. <laughs> Oh god no, he has arrived. Dark side. Well, I'm screwed. No, where is all the beautiful light gone? <laughs> You're gonna be so embarrassed when he finds out that you didn't kill a single one of us. Okay, shut up. Look, Luther, why are there like a bunch of heroes scattered amongst this whole area? Heroes, you don't say. How could they possibly be here? Wait, wait a minute. Is that... I think that that's Superman. Uh, <laughs> Superman, where? Turn around, he's like literally right behind you. Oh man, you know I got a bad neck, I can't do that. Why would you, why would you put me in a situation like that? Wait a minute, what's this? Are, are you on, are you on crutches? Um, pfft, these things? I didn't even realize I was holding these. Will you really let me down? 
You have failed me, Luther. Oh, okay, wait, wait, I don't even know what the word failed means. And jump on out here. Well, that's that. Well, I'd say that point pretty well. Yeah, totally. Well, uh, now I'd say is about the time where we all get away. Yay, we're actually doing something for once. Well, perhaps now would be a good time to come out of my hiding from under the debris. Oh, please do not tell me that was a joke about what I did during the doomsday battle. Well, now that you say that... <laughs> no! Shut up! Shut up right now! Shut your face! Oh, we've got a... We've got a feisty one. Bomb! No deflection! Ow! touch it, I swear. <laughs> you murdered your own son, Batman. Oh, Jesus Christ, Robin! Look at me, look at me, come on. I need my dick. That sounds a little wrong. Dick, no. Come on, stay with me, stay with me. I didn't, I didn't want to do that. I, I guess I, uh, no. You know, the very moment I first got you as my son, I just... I wasn't ready. I, I didn't even want you to be honest at first at all. I was just like, oh man, look at this random orphan dude. He, he's pretty idiotic too. You were kind of dumb. But that, that was before, that was before. And uh, now, I just, you, 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 you just didn't come far enough. I really thought we could finally do something. I it's just, yeah, yeah I, I didn't expect it to go so quick. I. I wanted to spend every moment with you. I finally had a son. I could do what my father never got to do with me. And now, now this has happened. <laughs> this has happened. What have I done? Please, please don't. <laughs> no. Wow, you wanted to do things with him that you couldn't do with your father? Yeah, that, that, that really touched me and my little clown heart, you know. <laughs> Joker, shut up. This was your doing. You... <laughs> Batsy, it's been a while, hasn't it? <laughs> you see... As I always got to remind you, the two of us aren't so different. You represent order, and I represent chaos, but in the end, we both go through our painful times. And the, the, our losses like this, this is exactly... This is exactly how villains rise, and well, look at you replicating the exact actions of Rassel <laughs> Cool. <laughs> what? Okay, first of all, how do you even know what happened in the Batcave? And second of all, absolutely not. Oh, well, okay, sure. We can all live in our distress. See you later, Batsy. <laughs> and so we have served some justice. Well, I guess we're gonna have to bury Dick in Wayne Manor or something. Uh, it's gonna be expensive, but that's just me for you, you know, guys? <laughs> guys, yeah, you know, I'm really sorry. This was kind of my fault. I, um, I guess what I'm trying to say is I'm done. I, I don't want to do this anymore. And I'm sorry to all three of you because I've really been undermining all of you. I've been ignoring you. And it's time I should stop. I mean, Batgirl, I forgot we were ever in a thing. I don't even remember when that was decided. Um, and Damien, I literally locked you in my closet for a few years. That's kind of messed up. But um, at least I fed you, so you're still alive. So that's good. And Alfred, um, just keep doing your butler thing. I mean, you know. Well, I'm certainly glad that you are willing to apologize and just let out your feelings with us, your your family, for once. And I am quite sorry about what happened to Master Dick. I, I really understand. This is exactly why you didn't want to get a family again, but 
I guess that's just the lesson you have to learn. Families go through many losses, but in the end, we still all love each other, right? Shut up, Alfred. You're the butler. I don't love you, but, I mean, yeah, I, I still love everyone else that's my family. Uh, they're, they're great, you know, Damien, you and I, and uh, I guess it's weird to say I love you, Barbara, because we're not really related at all, and uh, you're not even adopted. I think you're just, like, with me. Uh, oh, wait, we are dating, right? <laughs> you know what? I... Let's, like, make that a mutual decision next time. It was. <sighs> okay, sure, sure. Well, I wonder where we go from here. Honestly, this has been way too much stress I've been going through, this whole team. I called you a mess before, and it's very much true. I'm not going to apologize for that. Not at all. I'm just saying, like, I don't know if I could handle being your team leader anymore. This group of wonderful heroes, I mean, power-wise. <laughs> and, uh, I think I should pass down my role to the one who truly deserves it. That would be... My pal, Batman. <laughs> hey, listen, bud, I am so sorry. We didn't invite you to that anniversary party before back at the Fortress of Solitude, which was lit, by the way. And I, I'm really just sorry in general. I mean, we've been ignoring you a lot. And I'm going to stop you right there. I just did an apology that's pretty similar to that. And also, I'm done with the superhero thing for a while. I'm I'm hanging up the cape, if you know what I mean. Wow, okay. So anyways, how about Wonder Woman? I mean, I guess it's really not a big deal. <laughs> it's nothing, that's sure. Well, I guess we won't be needing this anymore. All I know is that Darkseid will one day return again, and when he does, he's going to be much more powerful than he clearly was. So, we have to be prepared for that day. You hear me, Justice League? And of course, Ra's al Ghul is still out there, and of course, that means the Lazarus Pit is out there, and everyone who just died can still very much come back to life. And plus, there's going to be a prison break pretty soon, as there always is, especially because they're going to Arkham Asylum, which is a very unprotected place. So, basically what I'm saying is, there's a lot of room for a sequel, so <laughs> let's be prepared at all times to serve some... Hey, look! Hey! <laughs> they were expecting an after credit scene from DC. Sorry. <laughs>